Hello everyone, this is Nuclear and I'm going to catch the game I played um, yesterday. Uh, it's uh, between me, the Yellow Terran, it's here on the 6 o'clock position against uh, Split, who doesn't split his mines very well. Uh, he's the Red Zerg uh, in the 11 to 12 o'clock uh, uh, position. Yes, he's going to scout this overlord to this uh, area. This is a new map, a season 7 map. Uh, it's called Metropolis and uh, it's a little different from the GSL version where uh, instead of rocks here you've got a uh, crypt tumor that uh, also blocks the, uh, the expansion so the Zergs can just fly and take it, they need to kill the, uh, the crypt tumor so yeah, it's, um, people say it's quite, um, it's quite balanced even uh, that way but now if there are destructible like rocks you need to make a drop, big drop or like a, a a warp of four zealots, or I don't know, drop for Ochi so you can kill it, and then just that, or just after that, you can take the expansion. But uh, as it was, you could just send the bench, kill a tumor, and then wait for the crypt to receive and just uh, uh, lift. That was easier, or you know, send uh, an overlord, or um, yeah, you know. Okay, so we're both going to scout. Um, he's going to scout directly uh, this position. No, he's not. I think um, he could have, or not, or yes, but that's what he's doing. So he's scouting there, and he's facing that. If he, if I'm not here, he will scout here with the Overlord. But that's quite risky because, well, it's not actually different. If he just stays here, but he won't be able to see my take, so he need to poke with the drone. Okay, now he's doing the poke. I'm. Uh, I recently found out that it's uh, it's better to just chase this, even though. Um, um, I never used to do this because it was a mining time and so on, but now I think it's better than uh, letting him to, to poke uh, the killing. So I'm making an old guess, um, a little bunk rush, I'm not sure if he saw it. Actually, he didn't see that, I can't believe okay, so he just now saw it. And I'm not sure how, how he did. I think this drone, and this is exactly this drone, can see it, this is the only thing I can see it. But is he going to react to it? Okay, so I think he yeah, he's going to react and send like a lot of rounds. And uh, I've got Marine on the way. And, uh, another Marine almost ready. And this uh, SCV here is trying to make an expansion. Okay, he's trying to make a mini extractor to so he's going to do it. And I, and I see it pretty quickly, guys. So my drone back, my SCV back, fine. Let's see. Now, um, the marine is coming uh, to go into the bunker, and uh, I think I'm going to be this way, right? Um, the the extractor finished. I'm uh, making my expansion, and I'm also uh, sending another marine here so I can do more damage to the hatchery. I'm trying to kill drones because I know the the trick won't work. And look, this is one of the coolest things I've done in StarCraft 2, so basically I did this. <laughs> that was amazing. I felt very good to swing game. It was amazing. Let's see, I, I never knew if I finished. Okay, so this uh, bunker never actually uh, was salvaged, but that's okay, uh, because uh, you can see the drone count is quite uh, in my advantage. I'm not going to kill any more drone, but I could have killed if I focused that one. Try to focus that uh, one long zerling with 6 HP, but it didn't work. So, yeah, the game is pretty balanced at the moment. Uh, except that uh, I have 4 workers on this uh, simulator. I'm taking the third uh, expansion because I've got only one simulator with 4 people on it. More go because I knew he had a lot of zerlings and I didn't have. Um, I had only 2 marines, so I needed to be safe. So, yeah, all in, I made a bunker and. Uh, this was risky if, if he had entered the game, I, I was just uh, rage at the end. I'm going to make a little uh, marine dance here, this one, as you can see, marine dance forever. Okay, still four workers on this gas, still no tech, I think I should have made a factory way earlier. I'm not sure when I'm going to spot it. For the fact that I need to make a factor and my mind is skyrocketing. Okay, so right now this is the moment I'm making two more barracks and the uh, factory, and uh, I'm also um, 
um, making an orbital command. I must buy though because there are three orbitals. Two orbitals is a fake faster, that's seven minute third. Well it's okay you can assume because I, I didn't uh, open it helions, I opened with one rex as expand and uh, not transition to helions. Still four workers on this gas. Okay, then going double eBay. This is more like a Korean style. I, I found out that uh, Koreans do this a lot. They make like mass marines, fast, um, fast medivac, or the plus run very fast because they miss the 100 uh, gas uh, and uh, fast, fast uh, upgrades. And this is what I'm trying to do here. But obviously, I don't have enough money at the moment. I don't have enough gas, more, more or less. Because uh, worker wise, we are equal because of the damage at the start. Even though I killed only two workers, um, I forced uh, early on or all the Zerians, or like eight of them. Spy wise, he's uh, a little ahead. Um, and I think he will go more ahead if he did this expansion goes unchecked. Uh, he throws some lore as a lot there of them, but uh, well, that's okay. I just thought it to see if he went for. For a layer, but he didn't, and that was weird because it was like me and there were no layer, and he had money for it. So I don't know what, what happened, okay, so just then to start to layer. But I mean, that's weird, like usually Zerg started at a 7 meter or 7.5 meter. He's throwing these rocks for a better, uh, better position, so he can defend it more easily. This early here can spot my turf, and I think he's going to. Okay, I'm making the first. Uh, Maybe back when I'm trying to move out, I want to I wanted to move out like when the steam finished. Um and of course that's a very very hard goal to do and I'm making the more barracks, I've got five barracks at the moment. And then armory because I want uh, when my plus one plus one finish to make to be able to make the plus one plus two I can supply blocks so please make some supply depots, thank you, thank you. I think I'm going to make four spread. Moment, right? So he stops. Did he see my push? No, he and then one well, did he make all these rings at 40 circlings. But he has a very, very bad economy, so I think the best thing he could have done was to wait here. See if I attack and I attack to make those rings, and if, uh, until that he could have made like 20 thrones. Mm. That thing. Um, going here, I'm not sure now if you can see because the creep isn't spread all that so far away. And uh, he's going around here, but he's in the dark, of course. I think he's now trying to take this um, a mega tower, but it won't matter because uh, my army is already here. And uh, the whole fact is that he didn't see that the rocks were killed. Um, he, he saw my expansion, that was very bad. I tried to make like a um, um, wall here. Okay. And because he didn't have this tower, he didn't, he didn't uh, see the medivac, so he doesn't know a thing about this drop, uh, this push rather. Because, um, and you know what happened here? Because I didn't see him there at the moment, I knew the Mutas wouldn't be so early, so I could attack. And if uh, something like that happens, I could just lift, because Mutas wouldn't come very fast, so I steamed. Well, he reacts quite quickly, I kill uh, uh, this expansion. Because the plus one plus one make, makes my unit very strong, and then I killed some more creative was six workers in my lift off. I think I could have, uh, could have run here or here if I had the time and do like a bolt attack. I try to um, try to spin my medivacs, I'll try to do here a drop, you kill two more, um, and uh, well, he did a nice job of um, splitting his army also. You can see some units were here, some units were here. And, um, this uh, this moment only I um, lost money. Uh, this medivac was here, and those marines were here. I think I could have killed those two. Um, actually, no, because the overall skill was done. So, yeah, I think I'm going to kill one or two zerlings, and then our units will die in oblivion. I'm dropping in here so I can take this Naga Tower. Okay, I didn't do that, but that was what I was, well, what that was what I wanted to do. I'm making plus one, plus one, plus one vehicle weapons, and I'm transitioning to tanks. Okay, I got two factories, and I'm gonna take lab. 
Oh yeah, the mute transition that sucked. Because uh, when I saw it, I guess you mute us quite soon. And then I was like, okay, it's bad. I need to make like a ton of, a ton of tours. I don't have a tour incoming. Or anything like that. Um, of course, Marines are very, very good against mutants, but uh, well, you, you need to make turrets to defend because you can't uh, just keep parts of your army at home because your army will be smaller and so on. So I made like five turrets here to try to defend it, and I think we made even more here, so seven turrets. That's uh, a lot of expedition, that's uh, 950 mirrors, and I need 21 drones, and I think he should have made this way earlier, but of course. Because he waited to be safe, and now he's gonna save. You can assume that, right? The only thing that uh, bothers you about him is that he, I've got plus two, plus two, and he's got plus zero, plus zero. That's extremely bad, and uh, I'm not sure I saw it, but um, okay, this is a. Uh, and so of course, I try to profit that, and I'm making here some few micros in the. And even focus this, and two mutas, now just died, so he two mutas died. I see that the units lost um, his bad control costs him a lot, of course. Um, he never saw this attack, so I killed the expansion. Uh, do I still have one? Okay, I've got two here right now. Oh, I don't know, I had four and I have two. I think I should start my plus two plus three as AP because as you can see it doesn't even have plus one plus one. This was a mistake. I should have checked for his upgrades and when I, and when I, <coughs> and I should have seen that he's got plus zero plus zero. And at that moment I should have attacked. Because this army, you can take this army, take it down if he's got plus zero plus zero. It's no way he can't. It was just an advantage, and I should have won from the start. I think I tried to drop something like this. I'll drop here. Oh, he already had a turning. And um, I'm going to try to save this expansion. It's not safe expansion. Because, um, well, it is because this already has creeps, so I think you can use spines here. He's got a very mobile army, he's got Muta Sensor, he's got the most mobile army of the other can make. He is uh, floating larvae in those cards, okay, this has have enough mind, that's true, but uh, it's because uh, of his uh, economy, because it was very bad, he made drones very, very late. He started 14, they just made army army. Not the best uh, injector, but it's not the worst, he's got only 18 energy, and he's doing it quite frequently, more or less. I went here to give some creep, you know, to uh, to prevent his uh, so he to prevent his uh, eyes to the, so he couldn't see his drop. I dropped here and I wanted to see him here, uh, but for some reason he knew about it. I think he wanted to go with a mutas in my base, and I try as you can see I'm trying to focus on muta, so he can like to mutas when I shouldn't should be killed any. Uh, and I'm making plus 3, plus 3, and plus 2 mech, and I'm making tours and some uh, more other more survey tool against uh, the AI of um, Bane. This tour is stuck, this is one of the things I need to work on, because you can see my SimCity city is very, very, very stupid. I need to start making the room, my buildings in order, so you can see my, my uh, units with the tours, and the fish tank can get stuck behind the behind the structures and give me the fortune I can uh, see the I should have sent like one tour and make more more turrets here. My my income was high because of all of these mules. Sad, uh, sadly mules are overboard. Uh -huh. And you can see he's got a huge army, he's got five point two K uh, I've got five point two K uh, army slaves at six K but the the thing is that I've got plus three plus three ninety nine percent done so yeah you see the plus plus two was done exactly when the attack happened. And uh, check out when plus one plus one attacks plus three plus two what happens. I see arm supply is getting higher and higher for me. My is refused to die when those medibacks didn't heal and it was fine but I lost this expansion because I didn't pay attention. That's one thing I should work on. It was the fourth or second game of that day so I wasn't really my 100%. But uh, I knew it was over when I killed his big army because there was no way, because he, I killed his turret, there was no way he had uh, that much of a gun so he can uh, max out the end. That wasn't a max out turret, it was a 180 at least. So if he wasn't max out that one, then I would think a pole, this is a pole, basically attacking this choke, and he's gonna open 
cineva el căută politică să zice să fi spus și de a fi o realizație, dar să-i spun și că tu mai diversi, să rog și tu mai diversi să-ți schimb, să vii să-i spun și 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 să-i spun And that's why I say no problem of ice, so she played really well off because he didn't see the push and so on and kill him. She lost uh, when you had you and you know, have you could have micro better and so on. Okay, so thanks for watching it. Um, and I wait you to see more cases, right? Right, subscribe if you can and so on. Thank you, thank you very much.